Oh my god! Okay, can't really bring out the energies, but this video just want to basically uh, document down the Alcaf court view uh, because the homeowner has shared with me that she will receive her keys in the mid October. Just want to let viewers know that at the end of this video, uh, what you are going to receive or perhaps uh, witness is how I plot out the dates that the homeowner can consider using for the significant activities. So what I mean by significant activities is definitely because everyone will define activities differently. For example, that homeowner wants to roll a pineapple because she wants to welcome that home. That's also possible. For myself, uh, the three main activities will be first, uh, definitely go into the home for the first time. Next is the renovations because I want to make sure that uh, I don't activate the negative energies, especially with the annual Flying Star 5. The next date that I look forward to is actually got two commencement of the renovation and after that, moving into the new home. This video, I'm just going to share with you what are the personalized dates because she also gave me the parts charts of the home occupants and herself that's why it's very personalized uh, if you would like to uh, get yours done uh, the description is found in the comments below if not let's continue this is really a big challenge for myself because uh, when the first time i went down to that place uh, it was really a field feng shui site visit why because at the point of time everything was barricade up but now uh, the barricades have been taken down uh, people have started to live in so definitely the the tree the man heaven earth and man have all come together that's why uh, we'll take the charts of period 8 so when I went there uh, I look at the block that block was kind of interesting because you can't we can't really determine the building facing that Obviously, it is not obvious at all. After standing at level 16 for quite some time, notice there was some kind of difference. So uh, if you need to find out the difference, uh, it is referenced in the, in the previous video. That was when I discovered I made a mistake. The facing of what, my, what I thought it would be is actually different. So for this Alcaf Court view, uh, she was staying at this block 101A and her block was facing into one of the common spaces that was almost in the middle of this development. So that was the facing. Previously, I concluded that the facing was uh, against the traffic. If you happen to be at uh, uh, Upper Serangoon Road, so the road is coming down, I thought the facing was going was against the traffic, but apparently not because due to the presence of the common space that's in the middle of this development thus the whole facing change that changed the whole sun dates and would not to say worst of all but then to capitalize on whatever has been done or diagnosed or ascertained at the spot the facing changes the sun date changes the shenkong flying star changes so what you'll be seeing on this screen is that right now um, this November 7 to 22nd, right, is part of the sun dates of the opposite facing, right? It means the facing that I thought it was right, but it was wrong, okay? Nevertheless, serendipity of things, even though the sun date uh, can't be used, right, because the new facing that's facing the south, right now, the sun dates are out of reach. I just WhatsApp her. Ask her, are you able to get the keys before 7 October? Because apparently for if she's able to get the keys before 7 October, then it's still within one of the periods of the sun dates for her building that's facing south too. Yeah, facing south too. Uh, apparently she's not able to do so. That's why when reality sets in, we just move on with whatever dates that we can do. So she still wishes to renovate or commence a renovation in November and serendipity of things. I was looking at this particular date. If you look at the screen, there is the success date on the 12th November. The renovations uh, will commence in November and we wouldn't want it to disturb the five yellow. 
us, we will always select a full metal day, which is the Geng Shen, the metal monkey day, to put the metal plates at the east. Because for 2020, the annual flying star 5 goes to the east. So we want to make sure that we place the metal plates at a auspicious hour, which is definitely the nobleman hours of the homeowners. Okay, so I also decoded that and it's going to be in the goat hour or the monkey hour 1 p.m. to 3 p.m. or 3 p.m. to 5 p.m. Amidst all the errors that I've made, there is something good because it is on a success day and the next day itself is a full metal day. That was a very good time to place in all these significant activities uh, to align with the date selection and on the 19th, uh, that's when we will commence the renovations because the renovation is going to probably take some time so there will be another like another date that will be selected to move in with the challenges uh, manage to turn it around though it's not the best but reality sets in make the best out of the whole situation uh, if you have a home or you have something in mind that you would like to personalize for yourself you can reach me uh, via the methods that I've written in the video description below. Thank you for watching. Look forward to seeing you in the next video because the next video is about can reach Hill Residences and it's an approved project. That's what I want to share. Bye bye. Thank you.